For the best experience, play with sound. Welcome in, Fiona. Look at that Domini Games logo. Wow. Somebody please help me! a little spooky the headless horseman was also the necklace horseman he had no neck welcome in everyone I'm your Gibbs and we're gonna be playing dark romance sleepy hollow this is actually the 14th in the game and I think it's the last one they've made and this one came out in 2021 it's raining it's a full moon and we are live. We've got the beautiful people watching on YouTube and on Twitch. Look at the color palette, right? Very strong reds and greens. Love it already. Probably some heavy blues too, you know? Got the primaries covered. Let's go ahead and jump right in. Ooh, look, red moon for hardcore. Love it. Is it going to be raining the whole game? Okay, good. Is it a killer in disguise or just a witch's trick? Constable Kane. Dear Kane, please come to Sleepy Hollow to investigate the mysterious Headless Horseman case. I've heard a lot about your past success, and our city needs a constable like you. Moreover, this is your hometown, so I'm sure the locals will give you a warm welcome. Sincerely, Katrine. Katrine, not Katrin. Welcome in, Kat. Good to see you. Yes, we are in Sleepy Hollow. First victim, local innkeeper. Second victim, third victim. A fellow K. Yay. Indeed. I'm a letter K, too. Yes, yes, yes. Would you like some interactive help? I think we can go with these special features. Why not? Why is there such a big crowd? Is that a dead body they're gathered around? Man, this just makes me think of old tiny Dirk parables, you know? I don't think they make them like this anymore. You know what I mean. So it looks like we've got some collectibles. Witch's toolkit. Oh, why is there a kitty cat? On the roof. What's up with that? Collect all the witch's belongings to learn more about the witchcraft. This indicator tracks your progress. Okay, we've got 1 out of 15 to collect, so don't forget chat. That's your job, is to shout them out when you spot them. Oh my god, the key broke! <laughs> Not all my detective tools are... Now they're all locked in this case. I need something that will give me a good grip. Ooh. That's our hint lamp. I hope this will light my way during my Sleepy Hollow investigation. Katrine is another variation of my name that has a Greek origin. Cool. Very cool. So this really is a game all about you then, Kat. The Headless Horseman. Top secret. Ooh. Oh, right, right, right. 
So the Dark Romance series has us switching between characters, right? And they have their own inventory bars. So I guess we're a bro here. We're not Katrine at this moment. No, wait, is Katrine the name of the detective? I think so, yeah. I've missed Katrine all these years. I can't wait to see her again. Mr. Kane of Varvik, for your impeccable police work, we're ready to accept you into the secret agency. Your, oh, he's another K. Look at that, his cane. Your courage and ingenuity are exactly what we need. All information about this agency is strictly confidential. And we can't write everything here. Contact your police chief. He'll tell you how to find us. Welcome in, JJ. Yes, we are just starting. You're right on time. Welcome in. I'm doing pretty good. It's Friday. You know, it's the weekend. Hooray. How are you doing? I think these are the two characters. Oh, actually, I don't think so. That doesn't look like him at all. Dear Kane, please come to Sleepy Hollow to investigate the mysterious Headless Horseman case. I've heard a lot about your past successes and our city needs a constable just like you. Okay, that was the opening letter. So Katrine must be actually at the city. So this is Kane here. First victim, Rebecca. Second victim is Joe. Third victim is Walter. Ooh, got a nice little sexy little badge here. There are a lot of rumors surrounding this case. Everyone blames the mysterious headless horseman. But I'll find a logical explanation. Okay, so we need to figure out how to use that key. Find the magic stones to upgrade the mayor's room. Very good, very good. So I guess we're going to have these when we zoom in. We got our task book. It's amazing. It's my bro's B-Day. Well, happy birthday to your bro. Happy birthday. Yeah, I feel like we've been, you know, streaming since Monday. Why well, stop now, right? Why well, stop? <laughs> I, don't, I don't have any good reasons to stop. Nice horse, by the way. And I still want to know why there's a kitty cat up there. Uh, is Sleepy Hollow like a book or a poem? I never, I'm not sure myself, but... Brittany, hello, welcome in. I love that there's Cravens here. Come out and play, Cravens. Loving all these colors. Red, blue, green, yellow. Done. I am an officer of the law. Uh, how awful. Who would want to kill a simple chronicler? He didn't have any enemies. And his only friends were books and quills. Books and quills. Books are dangerous. Don't you know that? Look at her hair. Holy cow. I mean, this is quite the top she's got on, too. Very nice. Got a little bit of blood and handkerchief going on. Do you want to find objects? Oh, don't want to find them. Well, I think for now we can at least attempt this. Maybe he learned something he wasn't supposed to. It could have been about the witches. He did spend a lot of time in the old archives. Sleepy Hollow is a book and a movie. Right, right, right. Setting the clock here. Welcome in Raven, by the way. The one with Johnny Depp. That's the movie we're talking about, right? Is it true that witches have returned with the Headless Horsemen? My goodness. I hoped I'd never heard the sound of those horseshoes again. Does the Headless Horseman have, like, strange horseshoes on its horse? I feel like every horse makes the same sound, doesn't it? Ooh, look at all the pretty horses. There he is. There's no evidence except for the Chronicle's blood. They say the horseman takes the heads of his victims as trophies. Can you believe that? I mean, we saw him in the cutscene with like a bunch of skulls, so I guess 
we haven't technically seen it yet, but yeah. I like the one with Johnny Depp. Wait, did they do? They did. Kane, I'm here. I'm pretty sure they did Sleepy Hollow twice, right? Like back in the 90s or something, and then like, I don't know, five years ago. Didn't they do it twice? I could be mistaken. Who's this lovely lady? I'm so glad you've arrived. Did you see how many people are in the square? We're all shocked by the latest murder. Oh, this might be Katrin. Please, could you examine the corpse before the local police arrive? They'll only complicate everything. The setting here is fabulous, right? With the full moon, the dark sky, the thunder, and the, you know, the rain. This is nice. Soldiers often hunted for local witches. Angry witches decided to turn one of their soldiers into an assistant. They lured a cavalryman into the forest, beheaded him, and made him guard their, made him their guardian. He instilled terror in other soldiers. They say he's buried under a huge tree. There is no one has yet to find it. We got a map. Welcome in, Jules, and welcome in, Sarah Bear Paws. I see you over there on Twitch. Welcome back. We're playing Sleepy Hollow. I added new details to the city map. I hope this helps the detective who's coming here. If you're reading this, I'm probably dead. But I don't know which is better. To live in fear or to die and find peace. We have a pen nib. And we have a book inlay, one out of two, a bag, and a screw. How exciting. It sounds like Sleepy Hollow. Because <laughs> of the rain, it's just too peaceful. Again, kitty cat, why are you? Oh, oh, hey, no, don't. No. Oh, don't run away, cat. There are several horseshoe prints. I should examine them carefully. Uh, aha, so I have to basically get my case out of the carriage in order for us to do this. Got it. That craven is not bothered by anything. So I'm guessing this will help us. Oh. Okay, none of these things are going to help us. Hmm. Wait, didn't we play this before? Or I am confusing myself. I, uh, Sarah, um, I checked. I don't think I have, Sarah. Uh, <laughs> if I have, oops, we're doing it again, you know? I have played some of the Dark Romances, but I know I haven't played them all. And this was the most recent one. It came out in 2021. I'm fairly confident I didn't play it, but... Maybe somebody else can confirm or deny that. Okay, what are our tasks here? Let's have a look. Search the crime scene before the police arrive. I like how we've got these nice thick leather gloves on. I do like the Dark Romance series myself. Um, I think it's interesting having the two characters like that don't share inventory. It's kind of quirky and I like it. Uh, okay. So I need to figure out how I'm supposed to get this. I actually don't see anything else to interact with. What does our map say? You are here! Available actions. Extras. Well, this is going to be an interesting way to do the map. It's fine to play the game again. It's fun. Okay, I do need to go to the body. Huh. Something shiny. Yeah, no, Sarah, I'm the same way. I play a lot of these Hopa games, and I don't always remember. Every time I plan to play, like, to, you know, play something new, I'm using air quotes new, I have to, like, double-check my, my YouTube channel just to see if I've played it already. <laughs> Why is there jam everywhere? 
I often think that the horseman is controlled by witches. By the last witches... But the last witches were expelled from town many years ago. Maybe one of them stayed, and now she's among us. She's among us. Uh-oh, she's among us. Brittany, I am fully aware of uh, Pal World. I've played it quite a bit of it, actually. It's a fun little game, isn't it? Pokemon with guns, right? Now we have our detective case. Let's go ahead and slap that down here and become a detective. Crafting a fitting horseshoe and shoeing a horse aren't easy. The murderer is an amateur, but a real equestrian expert. The horseshoe prints disappear right here. As if the horse just vanished. How did the killer manage that? The murderer was clearly on a war horse when they cut Anro down. Heavy due to horseshoes protect the horse's hooves. Oh wow, we have four horseshoes. You need to replace the horseshoes every month or two? Wow, I didn't know that. Ah, uh, Mr. Varvik. I've heard about your investigations in New York, but I'd hoped I'd never see you in my town again. Mind your business, and don't even think of coming near my daughter, Katrin. What's done is done. Don't stir up the past. Katrin, go home. Sheriff McCollins will keep an eye on you. Mr. Varvik, allow me to accompany you to the hotel. Oh, Dad seems like a charmer. Good evening. I'm Judge Barrett. You must be Mr. Varick. I'm so glad a competent constable has finally arrived to help us with the murder case. We've prepared our best room for you. I'll see you later. I'm sorry I was so harsh with you in the square. The residents have gone wild since the latest murder, and I've become anxious. I have a lot of responsibility on my shoulders as the mayor. Here, I took the liberty of ordering you some warm tea. Please, drink it. It was cold outside. So he's, like, treating me like shit, and now he wants to give me a nice cup of tea? Not poison or nothing, right? Oh, shit, it's totally poison. <laughs> I'm calling it. He's evil. What a fine gentleman. Well, well, well. I knew it! Sarah, you read the tea leaves, did ya? The hotel's on fire, I must warn Sheriff Colin. Kane's in danger! But first order of business, though. Yeah, yeah, get to the burning hotel. Sure, eventually. First order of business. Oh, I see, we've got some morphing insects, it's saying here. Alright, collectible. Always important. 15 of those. But let me start this again. First order of business. Oh, wow. We can actually play with the carpet. That's crazy. Ahem. We have to have a little conversation with Simon. You cutie here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Barbara, welcome in. Sometimes you got to poison a dude. <laughs> Are you saying that from experience, Barbara? Should we be afraid? For, you know, the dudes should be afraid. What about the dudettes? Uh, we are, have just started the game, Jules. We just started. That is a cute kitty. What am I going to do with you, Simon? Hmm. We're going to have to figure out what to do with Simon. 70 magic stones. Damn. Those are nice flowers. The gardener forgot to trim the trellis. I'll cut the excess foliage. Foliage? Foliage myself? Foliage? Foliage? I don't even know how to say that word. Hello, Sheriff. The fire is none of my business. The mayor told me to keep an eye on you, and that's exactly what I plan to do. 
Okay, a little sketchy. Don't worry. The firemen must be on the way there. Ah, I forgot to give you a letter from Judge Barrett. Here, read it. <laughs> 